This is one story called The Undocumented Worker. I will read it in English over here. So if anybody wants to read it from here, they can. I'm going to say it in English, translate it, and then I'll go over back to the English site. The Undocumented Worker. A contemporary story through symbolism. Read the painting from top to from bottom to top. Excuse me. A contemporary story through symbolism. Read the painting from bottom to top. One, the immigration helicopter looks for the undocumented worker who is already a part of the landscape. People are caught and put in boxes on display. Two, the road, which is the orange. The road and the fence, two realities of movements. To be caught and eaten by the border guards, monsters, or to fall from the sun's heat like Icarus. Three, back to black. After crossing the border, we possess two hearts, one on fire for the homeland, the other of water for the river. We are bodies without faces. Monsters and disasters follow us through the mountains. Our strength turns to flames. For the orange. Chase, change is not a dream. We can leap over history and monsters. Not even the stars are out of our reach. Five back to black. Barriers, walls, and fences, fences must be moved, must be broken, must be broken down between countries, between people, between neighborhoods. So that's this side. It says read from the bottom. And I won't be able to get too much of to the top. From the bottom to the top. So there's one, two, three, four, and five is a person breaking down walls. Uh, yeah, my zoom fades out. Come back down. The top one up there, the second to bottom is uh, a somebody reaching into the stars and his top half becomes stars, his bottom half is on land. Uh, I don't know what the rest of some of that is. The bottom part's interesting, it's like a toilet paper hanger and a guy with his shirt. Buds into a river from the head to the river, it's very interesting. There's a blue heart with flames and a rainbow going over it. There's a plane on the left facing down. This bottom one, on the top right, it has Icarus. A man turning into Icarus. His one foot has a shoe on it, the other one has nothing. Oh, on the left foot it has a flag and a boot. The flag is, uh, the Mexican flag is his sock. On the other one, there's no sock or no shoe because as the shoe falls off the flag, comes out, his sock turns into the Mexican flag and it falls onto the land with homes on it. I mean, just below that is homes on green lush soil and then below that is a barrier of razor wire and bricks. There seems to be on the left hand side a cliff with uh, wooden steps going up to like a wooden ladder and it looks like somebody's crawling into some sort of monster but I'm not sure it's a monster. And then it also shows a river on the left, on the bottom left, a highway, stairs and a tunnel and a pyramid and a stalk of corn all the way to the right. I was reading that from the river to the road to the pyramids. The river to the road to the pyramids to the corn was left to right. This next one, which is number two technically, the road and the fence, two realities of movement to be caught and eaten by the border guards, monsters. Oh, it's number one, excuse me. Contemporary story through symbolism. The immigration helicopter looks for the undocumented workers who's already part of the landscape. People are caught and put in boxes on display. So there's a river. Gotta get closer. There's a body of water and a river. It kind of looks like it's going up onto the ground, the mountains, and there's a helicopter with numbers 55 on it. Spotlighting anybody at night going through the mountains to get across to safety. And there's two walls on each side for the border and the boxes. And it, 
above that, in the same picture, is a bunch of sea life being free, and then on the right-hand side of it, divided in, is the sea life put in cages.